Hello everyone and welcome back to the Letters B. My name is Bobby and today I'm going to show you how to render your videos with a transparent background just as you requested. But before that, I would like to thank you all for the stunning support so far. It really means a lot to me to see you guys appreciate the hard work I put into these videos. I really try my best to make them as interesting and easy to understand as possible. I always wanted to create high quality content on YouTube and build a community around it. And I think with your guys' help, this is definitely achievable. Nevertheless, let's jump right into our tutorial. To render something with a transparent background, such as the square we created in the previous tutorial, we need to select the element that we want to render first. Also, make sure that there's nothing else underneath the element that you want to have a transparent background on. Then, click on Render As and look for the format QuickTime 7. It's really important that you have the QuickTime player installed so everything can work properly. If you don't have the program already, I linked it in the video description. Open up the QuickTime tab and select the 3 megabytes per second preset. After that, click on Customize Template and change the frame size to high definition definition 1920 by 1080. This way we make sure that we have the highest quality possible. Then we're going to change the frame rate. Most people use either 30 frames per second or 60 frames per second in their videos. I'm going for 60, that's why I'm going to choose the option 59.940. If you are using 30 frames per second, you have to choose the 29.970 option instead. Now we're going to change the video format to animation and the compress depth to 32 bits per pixel color. After that, hit OK and start rendering. Now, let's get to the final step. After you're done rendering your video, import it back to Sony Vegas, right-click on it and select Properties. Then, open up the Media tab and change the alpha channel from None to Straight and Matted. Hit OK and you are done. Now your videos include a transparent background. I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you want to support the channel, be sure to subscribe, like and comment so I can actually see that I could help you. Any kind of support gives me new motivation to create even more awesome tutorials for you guys.